Today we're going to learn how to download and install the game's software for Mac. The first step is to navigate um, in your favorite browser to the group website that is uh, www.msg.cam.istate.edu. The next step is for you to navigate to the games uh, toolbar right here and then wait for the drop down menu to appear and go to the download uh, option. Here, this web page displays a uh, decent bit of information about games, a little bit of history, but our main interest is the big red bold letters right here that say obtaining games. We can click them, and now we are present with the games user license agreement. This is quite important, and you should read it before clicking I agree to the above terms. You should do that in general for any type of license you read. So now that we've read it, um, we can click that we agree, of course, and now we're faced with the games registration system. This is the way you will get your download link for games. Uh, so first of all, we can type up our email. And you can click the type of version you want for games. We're interested in Mac execution, so we're going to click the binaries, the pre-compiled binaries, because we don't want to compile it. For Apple Mac OS 10, um, we click this and then we can navigate down and click on submit request. This will take a few minutes, but then you should receive an email that looks exactly like this. Um, you can go click on the download link that's right here and it'll take you to the website where you are going to be able to download games. Um, you're presented with a username and a set of passwords that will be good for a week and then another week so in case you downloaded it and forgot about it you can take back to it whenever you want from here we have to select um, the um, version that we're interested in which in this case is the latest one for all current Macs with OS 10, 10.11 or later um, if you have an older one um, you can select older versions which should work however I cannot guarantee that they have been tested so it is always best to select the latest one so we click it and this will trigger a download of a tar file which contains our software so the next steps can be done in a terminal we can fire up our terminal right here and probably you want to make a directory where you're gonna put your games installation right here is where we're gonna install games so now we're gonna fetch this from our downloads folder so this is called games I think it's OS and the entire of the path and then we can copy it right here this is a tar file which is like a zip with a different name and in order to unpack it you can just do tar.xvf games uh, dash os 10 dot blah 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 and wait for the magic to happen this uh, successfully creates a directory called games which contains the binaries and some input files that we can try to run in order to test our installation always 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 read the readme file which here it specifies how we should run the software so we exit out of here and we can grab an input file from uh, the directory tests standard and we can grab exam01.imp or .imp or .input however you want to read it so the next step would be to execute the program which would be dot slash gms exam01.imp however uh, there is a slight problem with this because Apple is very finicky with its software and it will say no. You're going to get such a warning right here and you can click cancel. You can open system preferences, go to security and privacy, click allow anyway, run it again. It's going to die again you click allow anyway again <clears throat> now you click open 
and now it's gonna complain about the game's executable you click allow anyway and sometimes the calculation might run sometimes it might not so I would just rather here kill the calculation remember control C and then run it once again we redirect it to log we say open and now the code should execute so we can now open our log file and see that indeed we have successfully ran a calculation this is how you install and execute games for a Mac thank you